what's going on everybody it's your boy dude clay aka clay kardashian aka don Tolliver's best friend kevin yeah i look like i'm cool and everything right now but i am underneath a great amount of distress so half just facetimed me and told me that uh i gotta drop a tutorial or work on some type of tutorial in the next two days or he's gonna give me a purple nurple uh jokes on him though i like them uh, but today we're going to jump into this tutorial talking about this type of cover, the type of covers that you see, that's type of covers that you see here, that's the type, that's the type. Alright, so let's get to these covers, you feel me? What you're looking at right now, of course, is a cover that I made for Palace. Usually when I make covers for Palace, they're kind of like the 3D renders that I get from my boy F Render. I, I don't know if I can curse here. I don't even know if his name is a curse because there's a V in it, but I'm going to put it right here. Put it, put it, no, do it like this. Put it. Put it like this. Chambers do it. Put it where, like, if I'm pointing at it, like, how they doing, like, look, move it around, though. <laughs> Making you work. <laughs> All right. So, so what we're looking at, chrome slash metal text, the glass, 3D renders, and then also I put, like, the 808 Mafia logo in there, made that chrome stickers. Real simple, something real quick that we can, like, do together, which is really simple. Um, if you guys are nice, I'll leave this PSD at the end of the video for a free download. You little ugly bastards. So, F renders. That's where I get my renders from. Hit him up. He'll give you a link to his secret website, which I'm not going to share with y'all because none of your damn business. Usually start out with a blank background. You understand? You feel me? No cap. So we're going to take this. We drop that up in there. You feel how I feel? How you looking at it? You feel me? That's the render that I got from. You see how sick it is? Look at the texture. Look at the grainy. You see how the chains. She touching it. She got a manny and a petty. I almost threw up. Took this little sticker right here, you feel me? Go ahead and size that mofo up real quick. You feel me? Size them up. Drop them off over here. That's too big. You feel me? It's a little speed video for real. Cause I want to make I want to see if I can do this under five minutes. AKA, I want to see if Chambers can edit this under five minutes. Shout out to Chambers too, yo. Real is producer, videography, sex tape model. He's amazing, yo. Alright, so we need to take the 808 Mafia, you feel me? Cause you already know. Play the tag if you can, Chambers. I don't like you, Clay. Did he play it? No, no. He didn't play it, did he? Uh, Copyright, okay. I understand. Right. You're going to size this up. You feel me? Double click up in there, you feel me? You see where it says bevel and boss? We're going to go ahead and click on that. Also, wanted it to have like a slight little blue overlay on it. Color overlay. And I want this to be like a little bit of the blue that's there. Let's get a little bit of that blue in there, if you don't mind. Get a little bit of that blue. We're going to bring down the opacity. You don't want it to be too blue. We want just enough blue reds, but it's everyone's happy. Y'all came to see me. Y'all came to see me. <laughs> I can book your mother. Hey, don't wait, Mafia. Go ahead and get this little glass thingy right here. I'm going to go ahead and come this kind of clockwise. I'm going to go ahead. This is. This is racism. <laughs> it's racism. That's what it is. I'm going to go ahead and pull this back like this. You see how I do that glass? Make that glass a little bigger. You don't got to do it like me. If y'all know some shortcuts, do some shortcuts. But I don't take no shortcuts because I'm a real one. You feel me? Also, I don't know any shortcuts. But if I did, I'll use them. I'm going to go ahead and start with the text. You feel me? Yes. Open that mofo up like that. Like how I did when I do that. You feel me? We're going to go ahead and rotate this. Clockwise. Go on, put that boy name up in there like that. That boy, I'm gonna make sure you lining up with that boy name. You understand what I'm saying? Bezel and boss. I'm gonna go ahead. I got it gray right now. I'm gonna go ahead and make it white. It just looks better when it's silver like that. You understand what I'm saying? I know y'all was looking at me while I was looking at this, but I'm gonna pay y'all attention. This is about you today. This is about you. We're gonna do like a little bit of that blue overlay, color overlay that we did over here. Mm. Mm. That's good. I like that. The part that's supposed to be loop kit. Same process, you feel me? And then also it was volume V1. If you know what, what, what that is and Roman numeral, we'll put that below. Cause I don't know, I didn't go to middle school. V I, you feel me? Same process, boom. Oh, a little barcode thing, you feel me, boy? Got that, make that thing a little small like that if you don't mind, boy. Simplicity is like the way you wanna go when you making like kits like this, cause what's really gonna pop is the art that you have in the middle, you feel me? Especially when you're collaborating with other graphic designers, if they already bought the chicken, you just wanna make sure you got the sauce and the dipping sauce, for real. We already got the chicken, uh, we just need the dipping sauce, and I'm stupid. I'm hungry. That's what it is. That's the only way I can explain this. I'm gonna go ahead and we're gonna. I keep on opening that. What tab is that? 
X video. Now, we're gonna go ahead and jump into adding this texture. The texture that you guys see all the time that everybody use, but we wanna bring this down because what we wanna do is lay the texture directly on top of the art. And the reason we're doing that is because I don't want all that grain to be on top of the stickers. I don't want it on top of the text because I want it as though it's like a 3D thing, how as though it's up like this and you lay it down and everything's layered. So what I'm gonna do is go ahead and hit this and I'm gonna hit it with a little bit of screen, but I'm gonna go to the opacity and we're gonna turn that opacity down to 33. Why 33? Because I said so. If I find out you put your opacity on anything but 33 in your graphics, I'm running your fade. I'm running in your mother house. I'm eating your leftover grits. Save. And we're done like that. Now, if you want to be as difficult as me, usually I just do that. Take that whole thing. You feel me? You saw what I did? Let's do it again. That's the hardest thing in a video. You're going to open this up. You feel me? You see this little folder thing? Pop it into a folder if you don't mind. And then you add a little bit of grain on top of that. You add a little... Coronavirus. Add a little bit of um, saturation, however you want to. Pretty much this is how it's looking. This is what we done. I'm in emotional distress because half forced me to do this. I wasn't even ready. I don't even have pants on right now. I just woke up. I'm actually going to leave this PSD in the bio for y'all because I bangs with you the long way. You understand? Go unfollow Steven on Twitter. Uh, go unfollow Greg on Twitter. Go follow Please Delete on Twitter and then unfollow him immediately. Do you understand? Do you understand? Do you All right. Shout out to Caitlin. All right, guys. Enjoy. Have a great day. Remember, thank you guys so much for checking out me and my kits. Remember, you can find my kits on Drumfly. Dot com. Remember all my graphic tutorials there. I got a loop kit coming. I got a brand new graphic design kit coming with my boy Kami. We finna shut it down. It's thick. It got so many textures, stickers, PNGs, uh, the notebook DVD, um, um, anxiety medication, uh, Royal Farms chicken coupons, um, chamber. Cut the video off.